x is equal to 4 root 15 divided by root 5 plus root 3. Then find x plus root 20 by x minus root 20 plus x plus root 12 by x minus root 12. Here you can see this part in the form of component and dividend root. That is, if you find the value of x by root 20, then you can find the value of x plus root 20 divided by x minus root 20 by component and dividend root. Same way, if you find the value of x by root 12, then you can find the value of x plus root 12 divided by x minus root 12 by cd root, component and dividend root. Here, you can see x is equal to 4 root 15 divided by root 5 plus root 3. Here, 4 root 15 can be written as root 16 into root 15. Because 4 when came inside, it will be 16. So, here 4 fours are 16 and 3 fives are 15. Here, 4 into 3 is 12 and 4 into 5 is 20. That means root 16 into root 15 is equal to root 12 into root 20. Now you can see x by root 20 and x by root 12. We have to find these values. Here x is equal to 4 root 15 that is root 12 into root 20 divided by root 5 plus root 3. That means x by 12 is equal to root 20 divided by root 5 plus root 3 and x by root 20 is equal to root 12 divided by root 3 plus root 5. So, here answer is x plus root 20 divided by x minus root 20 is equal to root 12 plus root 5 plus root 3 as per C and D rule. Denominator will be root 5 minus root 5 minus root 3 which is equal to here root 12 is root of 4 into 3 that is 2 root 3. So root 12 is 2 root 3. 2 root 3 plus root 5 plus root 3 divided by 2 root 3 minus root 5 minus root 3. Here 2 root 3 plus root 3 is 3 root 3 remaining is root 5 divided by 2 root 3 minus root 3 is root 3 and remaining is minus root 5. And we have find the first term. Now the second term is x plus root 12 divided by x minus root 12 which is equal to root 20 plus root 5 plus root 3 divided by root 20 minus root 5 minus root 3 as per component and dividend root which is equal to here root 20 is root 4 into 5 which is equal to 2 root 5. So root 20 is 2 root 5. Remaining is root 5 plus root 3 divided by 2 root 5 minus root 5 minus root 3 which is equal to 2 root 5 plus root 5 is 3 root 5. Remaining is root 3 divided by 2 root 5 minus root 5 is root 5. Remaining is minus root 3. Here denominator is root 5 minus root 3. Here denominator is root 3 minus root 5. So I will take minus outside that is minus of 3 root 3 plus root 5 divided by root 5 minus root 3. Now, when you add denominator is common. So, your answer will be adding these two together. That is denominator, common denominator is root 5 minus root 3. And here numerator is minus 3 root 3 minus root 5. Here numerator is plus 3 root 5 plus root 3 which is equal to minus 3 root 3 plus root 3 is minus 2 root 3 and minus root 5 plus 3 root 5 is 3 root 5 minus root 5 is plus 2 root 5 divided by root 5 minus root 3. Here you can see 2 is common in the numerator. So this will become root 5 minus root 3 into 2, root 5 minus 2 into root 5 minus root 3. So, this one cancel, this one cancel, your answer is 2. So, option A is your answer.